Welcome to the last day at Caloundra and uh, Caloundra, Caloundra, I don't know how to say it yet. I've been trying for the last couple of days and I seem to modify it every single time. So welcome to here. Here I'll give you a nickel dime tour of where we've been staying. This has been my little tech central with the VIP of the trip. That little guy right there that uh, has enabled me to keep all the batteries going and not uh, melting anything. That has been dad's nest for the trip. He loves that chair. And if I may, the Wi-Fi here. So there's this thing, it's called Telstra Air. I don't like Telstra Air. You'll notice that there's this lovely little, little table. And over here in the corner, there's one specifically placed chair. In order to get Telstra Air, I have to sit in this chair and I can't move. Three degrees this way, it's gone. Three degrees that way, it's gone. You find it, you log on to it, it says you're on the internet. And then you go onto the internet and the internet isn't there and you have to go back and you have to log back on. Then you have to find it first, then you have to log back on. And then maybe the second time it will pop on. But if you, <laughs> then you're in the dead zone and it's gone. I'm going to write a very complex, very challenging, very frustrating sound instrument. I'm going to name it after the beloved Telstra Airworth. Um, so that's the main living area. We've been staying back here. And uh, it's kind of been like a snore de force, if you will, because we've got the snore on this side and the major league snore, me on this side. So this room has just been lovely. This is like a Cribs tour. You know, welcome to our pet. Do you guys want to see something really scary? I mean like downright terrifying. My legs in shorts. They glow in the dark, it's crazy. It's not good. Guys, look at the view off our back deck. So those are the glass house mountains named by Captain Cook and oh my God, what a piece of paradise. I don't wanna leave. I sincerely, honestly do not want to leave. This is breathtaking. And I have been all over the globe that. I, I want that in my life on a daily basis. I'll just stay this pretty little inn and I'll live in room number eight. Please and thank you. So the first round of workshops are done, and I believe I actually successfully got my point across to people and I didn't rabbit trail too bad, and uh, they were able to take some stuff away from it, which is the ultimate point and purpose of, of why we're here, why I'm here, because um, I teach in a really unusual style, and uh, you know, I, I'm not wired like, like many players, it's all by ear, uh, instead of tap. So, really glad that I was able to, you know, take what's on my heart and impart it to to folks that are really hungry to learn and it was it was awesome 
here is where we've been uh, hanging out at. We're actually ready um, to do the uh, little master class workshop. I'm gonna get to sit in with the Sonoran dogs and I'm really looking forward to that. And just have this great room and the view of the Glass House Mountains are, ugh, just cannot get over that. Nope. Yes, there are a lot of bugs here. It is the very last night of camp. We are done, all the workshops are done. We had the student concert tonight, but there's a really epic jam right down there in Mark and Karen Miracle's room, which, well, it is no miracle because there's a bunch of bad, bad people in that room. <laughs> Bye. 